In the beginning, there was nothing. And then the ancient Greeks appeared and brought art and architecture into the world. Okay, it's not really that simple. There were plenty of people around before the ancient Greeks who had styles of art and architecture. But for the Western world, the cultures of Europe and European America, everything really starts with the Greeks. The paintings you saw at the museum, the sculptures in the state capitol, even the building where you went to pay off that stupid speeding ticket which was totally not your fault, but were all influenced by the styles of the ancient Greeks. One of the major forms of ancient Greek art was pottery. The Greeks were prolific traders of wine and olive oil, and so they developed special styles of vases called amphorae to transport liquids. These vases were of great quality and they became popular trade items themselves, leading artists in the 6th century BC to start painting them with ornate scenes of nature, history, and mythology. The Greeks became famous for their pottery. There were two dominant styles, called black figure and red figure. Any guess what the difference is? When a glaze is applied to the vase before being kiln fired, it turns black. In black figure pottery, the people are silhouettes drawn in the black glaze. In red figure, the glaze is used to create the background, leaving the figures the same red color of the clay. While Greek pottery was terrific, their greatest accomplishments were in sculpture. The Greeks were the first to really master sculpture, particularly in marble. Pre-Greek sculptures, like those in Egypt, were often stiff and rigid because the artists had not figured out how to carve more realistic figures that still supported the weight of stone. The Greeks figured it out, carving emotional, complex statues and reliefs of people in dynamic motion. Greek sculptures presented stories from history, notable people, and scenes from their mythology. Along with changing the way we look at art, the ancient Greeks were the first true masters of architecture in the Western world. While people built things before the Greeks, nobody had really learned how to make stone buildings. The Greeks did, and they established three styles of building that became the basis of Western architecture. These are the Doric, Ionic, and Corinthian orders of architecture.